I've seen a lot of people mention it and talk about HRT. I, I think that you need to do what's best for you with regard to the symptoms. I'm yeah. uh, a daughter of a, um, you know, a, a, my mother had breast cancer. My mother died from breast cancer. Um, I was always very afraid of doctors, period. Uh, when I went to the doctor, I didn't know, uh, I didn't even know I was in menopause and I was in menopause and, and HRT I was scared about. And since then I've really educated myself. So my next tip is to really educate yourself about what is going to be best for you, whether it's HRT, whether it's a, it's a different way you go about dealing with it, but, it, but neither one is, is good or bad. And I think that that's really important to, to emphasize that it's not, um, you know, I, I see a lot of back and forth about it and I, and I feel like people uh, need to do what is best for them and uh, you know her best year saying HRT does work for some people it really works for some people that's not the path that they choose but I think you've got to educate yourself and there are so many and we know so many of them so many incredible businesses out there that are doing it both ways whether it's you know it's certain types of supplements or teas or or whatever it is but I, I think it's important for them to research maca research things that might help with some of the, the various symptoms of menopause like the hot flashes the, the night sweats the you know uh the lack of a, a sex drive the dryness um i think it's important though to know your options and if you feel like hrt is for you then that's great but it, you're right ty, ty brooks is saying not one size fits all and um, it's hormone uh replacement therapy also known as Hormone replenishment therapy, you might also hear it referred to as MRT, um, menopausal replacement therapy. Um, that's what HRT is. It's estrogen, yeah. progesterone, and uh, testosterone oftentimes uh, put in, in there. So many different formats. Yeah. And yeah. you and I get to speak to, I mean, literally I speak to hundreds of menopausal women about their experience. <laughs> and um, they're all different. There's some through threads. You know, many of us suffer from hot flashes. Yep. Um, many of us suffer from weight gain, sleeplessness, yep. night sweats, yes. but there are, I don't know, what, 30, 60, 80, 1,000 symptoms, you know, that, um, including a friend who has a hot mouth. I mean, there's so yes. many things we've never even realized. Um, so it's really important that you approach it exactly as you're saying, as an individual journey, because everyone is different.